Hey, Power Zone kids, do you ever get the bad news blues? Psalms 112.7 says he is not afraid of bad news. His heart remains secure, full of confidence in the Lord. No, I won't be afraid. are beautiful and even though we know that they don't last very long, God still put just as much time and effort into each and every one of them to take care of them. That's what he's going to always do for us. He will always take special care of each and every one of us. We know there's lots of things that can make us so afraid. Um, you know, like, we can't go to school or play any sports because we might get sick. That can be pretty scary. But you know what? God This is thankful. Don't worry. This is Jesus, hey who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. Jesus did many amazing things. He taught everyone about God's love, healed people from their sickness, and even calmed storms. One day, Jesus was speaking to thousands of people. 
pays us. When someone asked him about money, he told them a story and tried to explain to the people that our treasure is not on earth, but in heaven. Then he turned to one of his disciples and said, That is why I tell you not to worry about everyday life, whether you have enough food to eat or enough clothes to wear, for life is more than food and your body more than clothing. Uh, I guess. Look at the ravens. They don't plant or harvest or store food in barns because God feeds them and you are far more valuable to God than any birds. Uh, yeah, I think so. Do you think that by worrying about anything, you can add a single moment to your life? And if worry can't do a little thing like that, what's the use of worrying over bigger things? a oh, good point. Look at all the lilies and how they grow. They don't work or make their clothing. Yet Solomon, the great king of Israel, in all his glory was not dressed as beautifully as they are. And if God cares so wonderfully for flowers that are here today and thrown away tomorrow, He will certainly care for you. And don't worry about what to eat or what to drink. Hey, okay. Many people worry about these things, but God already knows what you need. Seek the kingdom of God above all else, and He will give you everything you need. So don't be afraid, for it makes God happy to take care of you and give you His kingdom. So share what you have with others and give to those who need. There you go. Thank you. Sorry. Hi. Then you'll be storing up treasure in heaven. And when your treasure is in heaven, it's going to be safe. No thief can steal it. Whatever. And no bug can destroy it. Man, whatever. Wherever your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Well, guys and girls, that's it for this week. I hope you all enjoyed your lesson. See you next time.